Calling this blend the Brazil Numero Uno. It calls for 45% of the blend to be Brazilian, 25% Colombian, 15% Guatemalan, and 15% Ugandan. For those of you who don't know, roasters are mad expensive, so I had to settle for a popcorn popper. One eternity later. We're making two cups of coffee in the pour over, so we first need to start with around 33 grams of ground coffee and then pour in about 500 grams of purified water, obviously with a bloom. This is actually my first blend roast and brew that has yielded drinkable coffee, hence the blend name Brazil Numero Uno. I would actually compare it to hotel coffee, uh, so it's still not great. Still way too light, pretty bitter. As this coffee was drinkable, uh, it's going straight into the D tier. I uh, would not recommend though. 